if you can print it, I don't want it. So if you can print the dollar, I don't want it. You can print a stock, I don't want it. You know, I want something I can see, touch and feel, or like our friend Jim Record says, what's real. As far as what I call paper gold, people buy gold futures on the COMEX, they'll buy un unallocated gold forwards from banks who are members of the London Bullion Markets Association, they buy gold ETFs, they buy shares in gold funds, etc. And they go, I've got gold. And I say, no, you don't, you have a contract. Yeah. Uh, and let's see how the contract is honored. And so they have a rule. I, I'm actually enough of a geek. I've read all these rule books of all the exchanges. I'm a lawyer. Every major exchange has a rule that says they can change the rules. And so when they do that, everyone whines, oh, yeah, you changed the rules. Like, well, no, we didn't. We have a rule that says we can change the rules. When the demand for delivery overwhelms the amount of physical gold, they issue an order that says you can trade for liquidation only. What that means is that if you're long, you can sell and close out your contract and collect your winnings, or you can roll it over to a future month but you can't get the gold. You can't get the physical gold.